Hey guys, it's Cullen here. I'm back with another episode in my Factorio game. So, in the last episode, I boosted my um, copper production. Pretty happy with that. That's a sh lot more copper. I think it's actually more copper than iron. Uh, about the same. We got enough trains to handle it, so we're good. We got research going on. Over in my weapons facility over here, let's get a, a factory going. You're going to make us some laser turrets. Right. Now you're going to have a requester chest right in front of you. No. Laser turret. Right. And we're going to move you over here. So I can put a power pole on the outside. Sweet. And then you're going to have a... Do I have anything on my inventory that would speed that up? Alright, so we want to just throw that into a box. Of course we don't have any... We good. Uh, we certainly don't want more than one stack of those. You're gonna just work. Um. Oh, that's a shame. But I kind of understand it. Whatever. How's the batteries going? They have lots of batteries. We have a really good supply of batteries. Okay. That's handy. We have no heavy oil. Well, very little heavy oil. We have a lot of every other oil. So, basically, I'm going to run over here. I'm going to kill these biters. Again more, more biters, and then by the time I get back, maybe, just maybe, we will have a, uh, some more turrets ready that I can kill biters with, and I might do a base creep on the right hand side. Can't help it. They must be removed. Cool. It's a shame these trees don't grow back. And they're still classed as a tree, but... I don't have that much rocket fuel. And that reminds me. I could... Certainly make some, uh... new rockets
Not that I want anything over here, but... It dead? Almost dead. Simple. Easy. Actually, it's at uranium. 300k almost. Let's quickly run up this side because I just want to explore kind of this edge of the map. You know what I don't have? Um, kind of wish I could fit more in there. Did I end up doing um power armor make two? Maybe. Oh, that's a pretty big base. It shouldn't really be too much of a problem to get in there and destroy it. The only concern is my low fuel count. So let's not get in there and destroy it just yet. I don't think we're running out of iron anytime soon though. Please research that for me. Nice. Them I don't mind. But it still took six ammo to kill them both, so. Let's see if the laser turret can uh, kill this base. The only problem is these big worms. Not that I need much on this. I, I really, really... I think I might have to go back to RSO one of these days. Because uh, I'm not enjoying the uh, this terrain. I think uh, the patches are way too big. I, I thought... Uh, oh yeah, rail world setting. Nope. Not quite rail worldy enough for me. <laughs> That's fine. We can, uh. They're way too frequent, I feel. And look at, like, how much oil is out here. Now, this is, like, it's just too frequent, but. That's alright. Oh, we searched up here, we found. 
another iron ore patch. There's a uh, copper ore out there. It's probably not all of it. Alright, let's go and do a... Destroy a base. That's quite heavily forested. We might need to uh, look at another coal mine. Did I just blow them up? <laughs> or I could just shift one of these side. What? Why is there no power on this side? Am I just special? Okay. Maybe I won't need to get another coal mine. Uh, yeah, because I just not. <laughs> okay. I should get a whole bunch of stack inserters though. I'm not even doing anything with this other line. It's <laughs> just sitting there. Alright, so. Where are we? How you going? 23. That's a pretty good start. Let's grab some of these. Ah, oh, they're cannon shells only. We should get some fuel before I go. Alright. Oh, and there's a train at the uh, station. As long as he doesn't leave. Ah, uh, he's still got a little bit. go. I think it was empty anyway. I think these guys are pretty much done. I, it wouldn't be much left in those. I still don't trust trains. So, let's uh...
Let's make a quick blueprint of that. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. And where'd you go? That one. So that's one, that's two. not as bad as I This is going to ramp up my uh, power production, isn't it? I think where the um, solar, not the solar, my uh, nuclear setup's good for 140 megawatt. Maybe a little bit more. <laughs> so what do we got left? You're dead. <laughs> Just, you're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Last one, make sure you're dead. And that's that base, all dead. That's quite a lot of corpse. Next. I wish I had uh, daylight.
Just means I can uh, strip these out without caring too much. a lot of foods. How they survived, I, I don't know. A couple have been blown up, but... I'm out of uh, these guys to place down. How are we going on repairs? Do I have enough repair packs? Burn this front row. <laughs> Burn this second row. Including those worms, goddammit. God, this method is like, it's the cheap way out, but God, it saves me a lot of effort. them out because they're no longer required okay strip these out because these are no longer required because I've already killed all that take them out and we can just advance a little bit further and they're all basically dead there what do we got left done all right so that's them done. Uh, while I'm out here, do I have any radar? I do not, but may as well grab another. Oh, I lost another ro another couple robots. <laughs> okay. That gives us another look out here, but I'm not sure there's much else I want besides maybe picking up these guys. But that's going to have to come later. Let's go to UR3 
and uh, grab that train back into town. I should probably look at removing these uh, uranium mines if they're dead, actually, now I think about it. Because this one looks close. What's left here? You with like eight. Come on. So. Let's put a. I was going to say let's put a tank there, but. Um. Is there anything waiting to go in? Yeah, no, we should probably chuck them back into the train. Right? Uh, you've sent all your barrels off. So what I'm going to do bit crude. That should drain this basically into here. It's like a little holding tank so it's out of here. Now I can do this and I can... You are still sulfuric acid, acid barrel. Okay. So now... Let's, uh, go to Geranium. This is going to take a little bit, so bear with me while I disassemble but not waste anything this time. Uh, that here, I kind of want them. Chuck them in there. Oh no! Anyway, we're all good. What else don't I want? I don't want them. So, let's just put a simple, simple chest here. Because I really don't want them. I need to grab some steel. I need to grab some iron. I just need to make a whole bunch of these barrels. Yeah, get all that shit out of my inventory, thanks. Wow, underground belt. I have so much of it. Let's take them with me. Uh, train, you are two? I need you to go back to town. Wait, wait. Train. I need you to come back to town. I need... So we've basically pulled everything out of that one. this just to uh, get a few barrels. <laughs> it's pretty funny. 
I should be making bullets, shouldn't I? Alright, so all that sulfuric acid is basically done for anyway, so... It's a shame you can't push it back into the line, but that is what it is. We lost a little bit, but it's not that much. So I guess we just nuke the whole thing now. Are we going to have enough room for it all? I hope so. I'm going to leave those radar there. May as well leave this station there. Yeah, there's still a little bit coming out of there. How much? 3,000. A thousand. Does this have enough sulfuric acid? Yes, it has more than enough. So that oh, he's not even on a belt. God damn it! All right, that's fine. kind of didn't want him at the station just yet because I kind of want to pick these up and sort of really don't want them all going to the next bloody base but it's okay that's a lot of sulfuric acid to be going to one place Do I have anything that I can get rid of? So I can pick the engine up. Nice. Why do I have wood? Okay. That's enough of that. Alright, so that train is done for... Oh! There we go. Well, so we killed some bugs. We cleaned up one of these stations. We might have to do some searching around here, but ultimately, I think we're okay on uranium. Let's go check the power station before I... do anything else. Well, that's chock-a-block. They must have just finished a, quite a large burn. Let's... Let's do a quick factory here. 
you are making ammo them you're gonna get them you're gonna get them I'm not going to make you request a chest out of that. But basically... You can just sit there and just chomp away at it. How are you going? How about you guys? How are you going? There's so much uranium there. It's fine. I'm not going to run out anytime soon. So let's stop making these. Make that last one. Okay. Uh, we want to make two of them. Let's get some more pipe. Thank you. Okay. We're going to lay on another three of these guys. I should actually be doing six, so. Wow. I think that's it. Yep, two more. Beautiful. I messed that up. You know what? That's not going to work. That's probably not going to work either, but we're going to try it anyway. Because that's what I do. Okay. And the only thing they need is some power poles. So. If I go like that and like that. Can I get one underground belt? Oh, I can. It's a bit squished. It doesn't look neat. But it works. I probably shouldn't push them up like that. But I don't care. Now what's our potential output? <laughs> yeah. I, I want to know what in that snapshot what power it was, but 24 at, I don't even know what they can run at. Five point eight megawatts, uh, twenty times five is what a hundred. 0.8 times 5. Um, that's 8 fives. Like, 
that's another that's 140 so that there is the perfect ratio for these guys because they put out 40 I can't remember who, who cares so these are they put out 40 right but when they're next to another one they put out another a hundred percent it's only when they're both on so that's 160 megawatt because they've both been putting out 80 something like that anyway we're gonna end the episode here and in the next episode I have no idea what the hell I'm gonna do next time but we will find out when I get there so thank you for watching and have a great day